the loudest lion. Deep, deep in the jungle, chimps are chattering, frogs are croaking, and birds were chirping, and a million insects were buzzing and humming. What, that's a lot of noise. It's time for baby Leo to take his morning nap. He'll never get to sleep with all this noise, said Mommy Lion to Leo's father. Isn't there something that you can do? Do, said Papa Lion. Do? I'm the king of all the animals. Of course there's something I can do. And he stood up tall and puffed out his huge chest and he roared. Quiet! And so baby Leo fell asleep. Then Mama, and then Papa Lion whispered softly but clearly so that all the creatures could hear him. If any of you makes a noise and wakes Leo up, I'm going to gobble you up. And all was quiet in the jungle, quiet as the blazing sun, quiet as the shadows under the trees, quiet as a baby sleeping. Suddenly, splashing and squelching, ooing and aahing, a hippopotamus was yawning in the cool, muddy shallows of the river. Quiet, said Papa Lion as loud as he dare, in case his son was still sleeping. It's all right, said Mama Lion. He is still asleep. Oh, well, said Papa Lion, but I'm getting hungry. Then all was quiet in the jungle, quiet as the calm after a storm, quiet as the sunshine after the rain, and quiet as a baby sleeping. Suddenly, <laughs> quiet, said Mama La Papa Lion as loud as he did, in case Baby Lion was still sleeping. It's all right, said Mama Lion. Leo's fast asleep. Oh, well, said Papa Lion, but I could have used a snack. Once again, all was quiet in the jungle, quiet as the trees growing towards the sky, quiet as the leaves reaching to the light, and quiet as a baby sleeping. When suddenly, oh, chuckling and chortling, sniggering and sn sniggering and sniggering and sniggering, snickering, the hyena was laughing, laughing like hyenas do. But nobody thought it was funny. Quiet, said Papa Lion as loud as he dared in case the baby lion was still sleeping. It's all right, said Mama Lion. Leo's fast asleep, <laughs> said Papa Lion. I guess my eyes are bigger than my belly. But Papa Lion rubbed his tummy and began to think. I do wish someone would just a little, make a little more noise and wake baby Leo up just for a minute. Yet all remained quiet in the jungle, quiet as a fish swimming in the river, quiet as a bird soaring in the sky, and quiet as a baby lion sleeping. Suddenly, a rumbling and a growling, a groaning and a moaning, a gurgling and a burbling, a noise like nothing ever heard before. Loud as thunder, loud as a banging drum, and loud as a baby's uh, crying. Who has woken up baby Leo? cried Mama Lion. Found out who it was, Papa. Now! Uh, 
it was me, said Papa Lion meekly. My stomach is rumbling because I am so hungry. The end.